Hey, Granny. Okay, make a run for it. Get out of the way. I gotta see if I can find your stupid cats. Cats? Hello? I'm, I'm coming, cats. There you are! <laughs> Mrs. Whiskers, I'm on my way! Can I... Oh, I got you. Oh, oh, you're, you're crapping out babies. Why? Why are you giving birth at a time like this? What's up guys and welcome back to Just In Time Incorporated. Now even though I'm technically finished with this game because I've beaten all the levels, uh, we've had a finale, I'm still returning today because you guys have been telling me that there are some bonus levels hidden away in the credits. Did you know this Justin? I'm willing to bet he knew the whole time. Strong silent type, he just wanted me to leave as soon as possible. But apparently these levels are a little bit rough around the edges. You know, preliminary development kind of thing. Kevin, get your stupid pants out of here. I'm trying to do an intro. Oh, uh, Kevin took his own pants off, okay? I'm not getting reprimanded on my last day. You can just keep walking. But yeah, like I said, I don't think these levels are going to be nearly as good as what we've played before, but I'll take any excuse to come back to this game. This was one of my favorite VR games ever, so let's see what the credits and bonus levels have to offer. Excellent. You chose to come view the credits. I promise you they are short. And if you suffer through them, I will unlock these vaults next to you. Ooh, Just I in see. Time Incorporated was developed by Second Wind Interactive to try and make large amounts of cash. I cannot verify the accuracy of this claim, <laughs> but what other motivation could there be? These two gentlemen made the questionable choice to quit their jobs and create this game. Feel free to berate them on Twitter if you hate it. I will also leave these deadly implements here for no reason whatsoever. I thought this was going to be boring credits, not a slideshow. These fine people also helped in various ways with the completion of the game. Due to budget cuts and general laziness, we were unable to make each of them a character. That's it. As promised, I will now permanently unlock these vaults so you may enjoy the bonus content. Oh, what were you, were you saying something? I was too busy taking off this guy's head. Do you remember when I first started and I was picking up these blocks and it was then that you told me that I could never take these gloves off again? Well, you know what? You can just choke on your blocks. Yeah, there you go. How do you like that? Holy crap, you guys weren't kidding. There are apparently six bonus levels. <laughs> okay, so let's start with bonus level zero. The first prototype. Age 10 months, what is this yellow thing? Threat, can you save the yellow thing from the red thing before the awful graphics give you a headache? Oh, yeah, level zero, I see. One of the early levels from the first prototype of the game. So this is probably gonna be awful. Oh, wow. Where, where's my little, British robot to tell me what to do. Okay, the red guy has a gun, red is bad. The yellow guy has his arms up, and I need to save the yellow guy. All right, that's pretty straightforward. Where's that bullet going? <laughs> it's just a stray bullet. All right, hold on now. I got everything under control. Can I hit a bullet with a bullet still? Eh. Oh yeah, that feels good. <laughs> We're just gonna make our way up to Mr. Red. Slowly but surely, I'm coming for you. Better watch out. You shoot your bullets. <laughs> there isn't even any sound. It's so quiet here. Eh. Oh. I don't know why I would expect any better. Okay, I'm just gonna take this, and I can't even. Oh crap. Okay. Uh, you need to take one of these right in your blocky. Uh. Ha ha ha. Did I win? I mean, that bullet's still going for him. Oh, I won. There we go. It's really weird playing this game without any music. So I'm guessing you guys respawn every time I come back, and that's perfectly fine because I should be able to... Eh. That's embarrassing. Moving on to bonus level one, a very early level created to test out real characters and knives and the fun of cartoon brutality. The Scorned Lover. 
Granny McPhee, age 92. She has serious enemies. The threat is defend Granny against the Grandpa Death Squad. Grandpa Death Squad. That's a great name for a band. Remind me to copyright that. Do we have a robot friend? No? Come on, guys. How am I supposed to figure out what I need to do with a giant Grandpa Kill Counter in front of me and half a dozen angry knife-wielding grandpas. <laughs> Lady, what did you do? Did you just bang a biker gang 30 years ago? <laughs> All right, I could take care of it, don't worry. I have knives. As we know, I'm a master knife thrower in VR, so how about we start with you? Oh, come on, please, please. Eh, there we go. That feels so much better. <laughs> eh. It's really weird because you're not actually letting go of anything. There's no top of the arc kind of motion. You just gotta kind of judge it. Oh yeah. I mean, I didn't wake up this morning thinking I was gonna throw knives at a grandpa's feet, but you never know. Can I just borrow this? Here, you can have it back. That's for you. Grandma, I got a bit of an idea. Why don't we give him a show? Okay, we're just gonna distract him because there's two and I only have one knife left. I'm just gonna shave this guy a little bit. There we go. That's for me. Eh. I'm getting real tired of looking like an idiot. Grandma, this is what we're gonna do, okay? I'm gonna give you the knife, and you're gonna finish the job. I know you got it in you. He's, he's coming, Grandma. You better get to... Eh. There you go. I always knew it. you had it in you. <laughs> oh, Granny McPhee. Don't screw with her. At least, you know, not twice. Why didn't they give us a frying pan in the base game? I would have loved to beat Kevin to death with a frying pan. <laughs> These poor guys, they they didn't deserve this, right? You... Wow, what a puss. Guys, don't worry about it. He's totally into it. Moving on to bonus level number two. Early level didn't make the final cut due to lack of slow motion mechanics. Oh, so this one might be relatively finished. Mrs. Whiskers, age 32 in cat years, Granny only insured her cats. Oh no, Mrs. Whiskers and any offspring are priority clients, so I'm not supposed to save Granny? Come on, give me a narrator, no. I get the feeling that's gonna be the case for all of these. I am gonna feel really bad for like, a minute at the fact that I'm not going to save Granny from this house fire and she's married. Sir, why don't you go in after her? Or better yet, where are the police and the fire department and the... Oh, screw it. Okay, we're on our way. Uh, I suppose I should take a weapon. You never know if Granny's not going to give up her cats easy. Uh, ooh, I hear cats. Cats? Hello? Oh, oh, I need to... Axe down the doors, I see. Okay, Granny's not on the pooper, confirmed. Let's check in here. Eh. There you are. Hey, Granny. Okay, make a run for it. Get out of the way. I gotta see if I can find your stupid cats. Cats? Hello? I'm, I'm coming, cats. There you are. <laughs> Mrs. Whiskers, I'm on my way. Can I? Oh, I got you. Oh, oh, you're, you're crapping out babies. Why? Why are you giving birth at a time like this? Okay, we, we gotta go. We gotta go. You're not gonna follow me, are you? You guys are just born. You're too stupid for that. Uh, uh, yeah. Just, just go, 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 go. No, don't go towards the fire, you little morons. Ugh. Where'd the other ones go? No, why are they coming back in? Don't come back in. I thought I threw you hard enough. Go, 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 go on. Go on with you. Oh, this is brutal. This is absolutely brutal. Okay, come on, come on. Hello, okay, you're gonna be Bob, and you're gonna be Joel. Come on, Bob and Joel, we just, oh, Granny! That's it, just block them. Just use your body to block them. I'm just gonna keep chucking them out into the world. <laughs> go find your mom. That's it, little Bartholomew. There you go, see, that one's learning to dance. Good for him. <laughs> is that not all of them? Are there more? Here, kitty, 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 kitty. Here, kitty, kitty, kitty. I don't know if any of them burned. How would I know? Oh, no, this is awful. Oh, they're coming back. Oh, there's cat food. Maybe catnip. I see, I see. That's why they're coming back in. What if I throw that? Granny, will you get out of the way? They were going after the catnip the whole time. 
That makes so much more sense. There. What are you willing to bet that they need to be in this thing? Hey, one, two, three, four. Oh. Oh. Okay, sir. Well, I have good news. I saved your cats. And even better news, you have more cats now. But, uh, one less wife. It's like I said, little cat. I'm going to feel really bad for, like, a minute. And, uh, yeah, you know what? I think that minute is up. Uh, gentlemen, I think there's something wrong with your weight or with my hand. Still not totally sure. Okay, this is very violent, so we're gonna have a little bit of a contest. We're gonna see who's the strongest. So, let's, woo, careful. Let's just come over here. This is for you. No, 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 no scratching your nose. Okay, hey, 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 that's cheating there, man bun. Okay, so you lose. Guess who's the winner? Up next, we have bonus level number three. Cut because excessive mechanism manipulation. Well, fun. Felt out of theme. Interesting. Fred Lovin, age 41, young at heart. Man. Fred's protest has gone too far and will end in tragedy. Yeah, I recognize this guy with the saw and all. It's gonna be interesting seeing him again. Narrator? Oh! His protest too far and is now in danger. Help him escape safely to the stolen truck. Oh my god. Yeah, he really did take this too far. <laughs> so they actually cut down the trees with him still tied to them, and now he's gonna go through processing? And you guys are all useless with your tie-dye and your sandals. Well, I mean, yeah, I'll do my best, but I have no idea what I'm supposed to do here. Is this a... Okay, that's a good thing. And then maybe I can move you along? Oh, okay. So you're gonna come to here now that the saw is taken care of. We're just gonna take this step by step, sir. And uh, a very important step is gonna be you ditching the clothes. What the... You have infinite clothes! No, wait, come back! You're, you're a miracle of modern medicine! Can I... Oh, interesting. So I need to actually cut this so that we can move on? Yeah, there we go. Okay, nope. Back it up, back, back it up, back it up, back it up. And we can get rid of that. And uh, we can hopefully... See? Where's he going? Oh, he got pushed back a little bit. He's doing fine. Okay, so let's just, uh, let's just get that out of the way. Okay, no, we're fine. We're fine. Can we maybe not be doing that? Yeah, just, just go over there. Go over there. We're good. We're good, right? You're coming down. You're gonna go through here. You're gonna go over here. Uh, I think I do want this on. Okay, that's gonna turn that on. What does this do? Oh, okay, so we just need to sort. Uh, he's a little bit out of sorts. You moving? Oh, I need to turn you back on. Okay, hold on. There we go. Keep it going. Keep it going. I don't know what they were talking about, this one being too mechanism heavy. I mean, it is different for sure. Okay, okay. Just, just a little bit. Can I, oh, come on, come on, come on. Can I push you back? That might have been a mistake. You're free! Come on! Oh, what do you mean? He was perfectly safe now! His name isn't Hippie, it's Fred, and he's an idiot because he was perfectly safe. Oh, I'm rotted now. Okay, so let's just... You go away, right? And then we get you moving. So I need to clear out the logs or else we're just gonna be screwed. So, you can... Actually, stay where you are. Come down here. You're gonna cut through that log, and then we're gonna sweep you over. You should stop, right? You're not gonna go any further, because I don't have this on. Right? Yeah, right around there, that's good. Okay, so then, um, um, yeah, you can go down there, that's okay. Let's just get you a little bit further away from me. Yeah, not so close. Little bit further. Little bit, little bit there. Ooh, careful, 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 okay. Oh, come on. Come on, I'm gonna need to get uh, a log. Can I, can I just get, there we go. We're just gonna coax him along his way. I think, I think he's all right. This is so broken. We, we, need, we gotta clear the way as we go. Oh, come on. Does he need to be on the, he needs to be on the log. 
Ooh, this is gonna be frustrating. You know what? Why don't you just hang out here? I'll deal with all that other stuff, and then I'll move you down. I think that's probably a better idea. We can clear the way to begin with. So, you can go to about uh, there, I guess. And uh, you can just... Yeah, there we go. Okay, a little, little bit more. Ooh, that's that's a little bit too far. A little too far. A little too far. Back you on up. I don't know if I can cut that now. I'm going to have to turn this on. Okay, can I do that? Hmm... Okay, I might be able to cheat. Hold on. Might be able to cheat. I'm gonna walk out. Oh, I'm touching stuff in the real world. Oh, what am I touching right now? Eh. Eh. Okay, I think that's good. What am I doing? I'm, I'm hitting things. What am I hitting? What am I hitting? Okay, we're... I pulled things. I'm, I'm caught on things. What's happening? This is why I play VR games either standing or sitting and not in full room because you get lost so easily. Oh, I think we're good, okay? I, I think everything is fine. We can clear this all out. Here we go, screw all of you. Go on, go on, get out of the way. Any single bump could just completely ruin me. Uh, maybe I should turn this on? Yeah, there we go. So you guys can all go down the trash. Maybe I'll just be a little gentle with it, right? We don't need to boop them too hard because this is pretty slow motion. There we go, just, just a little boop. Just a little boop, there we go, there we go. You're on your way, hey, 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 hey. That's right, okay. You're welcome, hippies. Now take that stupid log and plant it back in the ground and his sacrifice won't be in vain, right? Oh wait, can I? No, I can't go down there. I was gonna say, I, I remember the chick with the green top that we saved her at the church. Yeah, you know what, in retrospect, I can kind of see why they cut this level. Like they said, it is fun, but the physics just don't really agree with it. What does agree with it, however, oh yeah. That's the stuff. Oh, okay. Just in time. <laughs> Guys, I'm running out of things to hit you with. All I have left is a bottle. Not very eventful, so if I whack you with a bottle, it doesn't even kill you. Can I hit you with your glasses? I mean, I can, but it's about as eventful. I swear I'm not sadistic. I just want to see if I can... Hmm. I was gonna say I want to see if I can not kill him, but uh, I think that plan went out the window. So how about you? Do you want to give it a try, Mr. Groovy? See how long you can last? We're just gonna go for- oh, no, no, no moving. Nice clean shave. Whoops. Listen, you guys can judge all you want, but head golf is the whole new craze. What the- did I just hit it out of existence? Where, where did it go? Magic. So it looks like the last computer actually brings us back to headquarters, so this will be our final level with bonus level number four. Is it fun to bat debris around to save people? We weren't sure. How about you decide? So we're moving on to a war zone. John and Jane, 34 and 29, wrong place, wrong time. Rescue two of our clients stuck in an active war zone. Okay. That's a big ramp up from cats. And the narrator's gone again. All right, screw me. Uh, yo. Ooh, yeah, this is, there's a whole bunch of problems. I mean, I've never grabbed a tank shell before, so that instantly grabs my attention. Hey, hey, hey. I wanted that. Can I get another one? You guys gonna fire on my friends? Come on, come on, let's go over here. I can see you. I'm ready. Come on, put it right down center. Oh, 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 no. You're gonna go over here. You like buildings. Huh? Oh. Yeah, you like buildings. He, not so much. I mean, it's cute that they give me a metal baseball bat against a tank. But I'm more interested in getting over here and catching this. I so had that. Okay, maybe there's just no, oh, I need to stop the debris, right? Uh, how, oh, I need the baseball bat to hit the debris to save you. Now I get it. I, I could have totally caught that though. You saw. Well then, batter up. Uh, let's just go over here with you so that I can, oh yeah, I see. I see, so 
I just need to give everything a bit of a poke, keep it away from us. I'm getting crow flashbacks. Are you good, sir? I think you're pretty good. She is not going to be good, though. She's probably not going to be so good. Uh, ooh, that's pretty cool. Oh, the tank's going to get some. I like that. I'm not really doing anything, though. See ya, tank. <laughs> so you, you weren't in danger at all. It was just him. Which really makes me wonder if I can actually save this tank. Oh, come on. I can't reach it and it won't let me throw any higher. Who died? Oh. Weird. That didn't explode on her last time, but this time it sure as hell did. Okay. Well, uh, not really my problem. I already finished my contract, so see ya. But I think that's going to be it for this episode of Just In Time Incorporated, guys. And once again, I'm really upset that there isn't more. This is probably my favorite VR game so far. It is such a fun game to play. It's so easy on the eyes because of the art style. A lot of the more realistic games, they just they take a strain on you when you play them in VR for so long. But this was perfect. So if you guys have any recommendations for another game that you'd like to see me play, some people have recommended Job Simulator or Arizona Sunshine or Duck Season, stuff like that. Be sure to leave them in the comments and I'll be sure to pick more VR games to try soon. But thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you next time.